Now to the top story on KBU.com. Thousands of you have seen the video. A vicious block during a playoff game between Hutto and McCallum High Schools. And we want to point out it was a clean hit. Tough to watch for sure, but the refs did not throw a flag. It really is hard to watch. KVU's Christy Millward is there, is here. And Christy, you actually talked to the player who got that hit. How is he doing? Well, Mike and Terry, he wants to make sure everyone knows he will be okay. He says some websites have posted the video alongside a story about a Mississippi football player who died. But he wants everyone to know that's not him. He's alive, he doesn't have a GoFundMe account, and he's slowly healing. But he does think this hit may have been a blessing in disguise. By now, you've probably seen the hit. I was trying to make a tackle and I didn't see the receiver. It was McCallum High School senior Elijah Griffin's last game. He's the one on the ground. I didn't know what happened. People are running up to me. They're over me like, are you OK? Can you talk? Griffin went to the doctor where they saw that the hit broke one of his top ribs. I can tell you sneezing, coughing, yawning, breathing, all of that hurts. But they also found something else. Then he says, that not to freak out, but he says there's something in your arm and he says that it could be cancer. Cancer. While doctors will still have to do more tests to be sure, Griffin and his family think the hardest and last hit of his football career, the one to actually send him to the hospital, may have been worth it. I haven't been to the hospital that many times, but for them to x-ray me and for them to find this, I feel like it was meant to be. A hit meant to be to make sure an illness like cancer doesn't take Griffin to the ground. Now Griffin tells me he plans to join the Army after high school and then become a firefighter because he wants to serve his community. Now we also talked to the girl who filmed the video from the sidelines. More than 7,000 people have liked her tweet. Hear from her on KVU at 6. Christy Millward, KVU News.